What is up, Pats Nation? It is Patriots Global here with another video. And so the Eagles have signed former Patriot, and when I say former, I really, really mean former, wide receiver Jordan Matthews. Now, a lot of us know Jordan Matthews, and he's actually been brought up in my videos and just around the Patriots organization a lot the past couple of weeks. Well, maybe not a lot, but he's definitely been brought up quite a bit. Matthews was traded to Buffalo in the summer of 2017 along with the third round pick in return for cornerback Ronald Darby. And then he was basically dealing with injury problems while in Buffalo. So Buffalo released him and then New England signed him this past spring for a one-year deal worth $1 million. And then they released him this summer after he suffered a hamstring injury during training camp. The Eagles basically brought in Matthews on Tuesday for a workout and then signed him a day later for today, which is Wednesday. Now, you might be wondering, why am I talking about this? this? He's not signing with the Patriots, so why does this matter? Well, it matters because the Patriots were looking into him also. So, this is not a route that the Patriots can now go. Yes, they did just trade for um, Josh Gordon with the Cleveland Browns. But they still might be looking to add another wide receiver. We know that they had a workout with Kenny Britt, which we literally never heard anything about. So I, I can't tell you what happened with that because I have no clue. There's literally been no word on it. And then supposedly Matthews was able to come back after week three of the regular season. And the Patriots did say that he was a guy that they were going to keep their eye on. Sadly... Matthews will not be having a reunion with the Patriots. He had a very decent training camp and offseason with the Patriots, but I'm not going to go off and say he was great. He was amazing. The Patriots releasing him was stupid because ultimately they released him because they knew he was going to be missing a significant amount of time and there is a player that they could use on the roster that Matthews would have been taken up if he was still on the team with the injury. And if they had placed him on IR, he basically would have been out the entire season. <laughs> now a little bit on Matthews. He was a second round pick in 2014 that the Eagles selected. He's also the cousin of Jerry Rice, which I thought was pretty crazy. And he ended up playing with the Eagles through 2016, leading them in receptions his last two seasons. And he is also a has a very, very close relationship with their quarterback, Carson Wentz, who is making his NFL debut supposedly this week. But, I mean, we'll see. I'm not really keeping track on that. The Eagles are also having a lot of issues, especially at wide receiver. Offense all around is having issues, but... I heard that they actually only have, just like the Patriots did, three wide receivers. I mean, Alshon Jeffrey is still supposedly injured and all. So they really needed help with that. And honestly, it's a good signing for them. I mean, if he's healthy, he can make an impact. But injuries are really setting him back. I don't think that he's going to be a guy that goes off that we're all like, wow, top 10 receiver in the NFL. But I think when you have a guy like Jordan Matthews and you have such little, little, little depth at the wide receiver position, he's obviously going to come in and add some great depth. As a Patriots fan, I know we all were kind of looking forward to possibly seeing him back. Honestly, I kind of wish that the Patriots had brought him in for a workout just to kind of see where he was. The Patriots were having issues with wide receiver a lot this offseason too and still continuing continuously are but i guess after acquiring josh gordon they kind of were like well why do we want a banged up wide receiver that hasn't necessarily lived up to the expectations so just some news for you guys i mean if you were looking for jordan to possibly come back and see him play on the field in a Patriots uniform catching passes from Tom Brady I'm sorry to tell you but that isn't going to happen and he is no longer an option for the Patriots if they were looking for a wide receiver but that is it for today's video what are your guys thoughts on Jordan Matthews signing with the Eagles do you wish that the Patriots would have brought him in at least for a workout do you wish the Patriots had signed him what are your thoughts on this 
Make sure you guys also like and subscribe as that helps me out and the channel very, very, very much. Make sure you guys share this video with everybody you know so we can go to the Patriots Global Family and so they can get updated on the latest news. But other than that, I will catch you guys in another video. We'll